what's up guys welcome back to joe tutorial and in today's video i'm gonna show you how to fix vlc media player problems if you're currently facing any issues with your vlc media not being able to play videos or you're realizing that there is no audio coming from it then i'm gonna run you through a few things that you want to check to ensure that this is not affecting or causing issue for those videos playing within VLC Media Player. Before we jump in guys, would you mind taking a moment to give this video a like and hit that subscribe button because this will let me know that you found value within this video. And on top of that, the biggest benefit is that you'll never miss out when I release future videos just like this one. Now let's continue. So guys, the first thing that you want to do first and foremost is to check your volume on the lower right hand side and you'll be able to check both things so you want to check the vlc media player to see if it's mute like this or shown gray and the lower right hand side if it's like this then you want to ensure that you click on unmute and or in case you realize that the volume is really low then you want to go ahead and click on it and try to move it up to a higher volume now the next thing you want to check your computer audio as well to ensure that your computer audio is not low or muted so in case you want to ensure that you check to see that your computer is not muted as well so go ahead and check this to see if it's muted or not and in case you see like it's muted you want to go ahead and ensure that you unmute your computer right you also want to ensure that the volume is turned up as well and everything is working fine you can simply go ahead and click on this select audio output here so click on that and you can check your computer audio output here just to see if it has the right audio output selected you want to go ahead and click on that but we'll touch on it a little bit more so that you can check some additional settings but ensure that your computer is working and you have the correct output selected and what you can do as well you can always go ahead if you check to see that your computer audio is working and it looks fine you can open up for example youtube and try to play a video within youtube and see if that works so you kind of minimize the issue only to vlc so if it's working through other applications then you know it could be something related to vlc and not your computer in general right so what you want to do just simply go ahead inside the vlc media player click on audio and you want to ensure that it's not muted the volume is not decreased also you can check your audio device as well so you want to hover over audio device and you want to ensure that it is set to default or the correct audio output so you want to ensure that it's either selected as your speaker from your computer or if you want it to play through your headphones or whatever it is ensure that the audio device is selected as the one that you want because it could be that you want it to play through your computer speaker but you have a headphone plugged in and it might be selected as the headphones so it will not play from your computer speaker if this is what you want so go ahead and ensure that the correct output is selected and you want to go ahead and try again right so after you check that the next thing you want to do is head over to your tool section go to preferences here and you want to select audio now have a look at those settings to see if everything is okay and also check to see if audio is enabled there if it's not enabled then go ahead and enable it because that could be the issue and you want to ensure that you check those settings if you don't know what let's say for example something got changed and you don't know what it is you can easily go ahead and reset preferences and it will reset to the default settings when you install the vlc media player so if you don't know what settings you had before restarting this will definitely help you to get what those default settings and to make it work so go ahead and try that now if after you try this guys you're still having issues i would suggest that you go ahead and update the vlc player so click on help and then you want to simply go and check for updates and allow you to check for updates to see if you have the latest version of vlc player if you check for updates and it says that you have the latest version you're still having problems you can try to download vlc player yourself so you can head over to google simply type in vlc player download and you can easily search for a new copy of vlc player so uninstall it restart your computer install a new version of vlc player and check to see if the issue is resolved now guys if after that you are still having issues and let's say you realize it's a general issue with your computer then you want to check your computer audio settings so you can click the windows key on your keyboard and type in control panel and once you do that open up your control panel then you want to search for 
audio or look for sounds. And once you find sounds, you want to open it. In case you have a different view, it could be that you have small view or you have the category view. Most times it comes with a category view. You can switch the view to large and then click on sounds. Now, once you click on sounds, you'll be able to see your playback. Ensure that the correct output is selected again. So if you're if you want to listen it through your headphones or you want to listen through your computer speaker, ensure that the correct playback output is selected, right? So you want to ensure that this is selected. And once you do that, guys, you can always go ahead and right click and go to the purposes of that particular device that you want to select. And you want to ensure that the levels are okay. So you can click on the levels and ensure that the volume is there as well. And go ahead and check additional advanced settings and ensure that it looks like that you can reset those defaults as well to ensure that you have the correct output so go ahead and try these settings guys if you're still having issues then you can always go ahead and check your audio device so you want to go ahead and right click on your taskbar and simply go to device manager and from here you want to find your audio output so you want to go ahead and find your audio and you can right click on them you can expand them right here and once you find the one that you want to use, you can simply go ahead and check to see if there's something not working. You can simply go ahead and right click on it and you can go ahead and update driver. So you can simply click on update and you can choose to search for this automatically or you can browse your computer and let's pick one and you can choose between the options available and try to update those drivers to see if that solved the issue. Keep in mind when you're doing these things, you have to restart your computer. Restarting your computer will do a lot so go ahead and try to restart your PC to check to see if the issue resolved. Also, feel free to check for Windows updates on your PC as well to ensure that your computer is fully up to date and that there is nothing missing from that level that could cause this issue. Here you have it, guys. I really hope you found value within this video. And if you do, don't forget to take a moment to give this video a like and hit that subscribe button so that you'll never miss out when I release future videos just like this one. Thank you guys for watching and see you next time.